Hello guys, welcome to Daily Tech. Today we're going to be talking about the best Android apps for July 2021, which I think you will find interesting. So let's get the show started. Moviebase is a movie tracking app that helps you find and track movies and TV shows. It is not a streaming app. Sometimes I just want to relax on the sofa and watch a movie, but this becomes a problem as I have to jump from Netflix to Amazon Prime and other streaming services trying to find a movie to watch. This can really be time consuming and tiring and this is where Moviebase makes this process a lot easier. It allows you to search through a huge catalogue of movies and TV shows through genres, streaming services, upcoming movies, TV shows, actors and actresses. I really like this app because of its attention to detail and the fact that it contains everything I need to choose a movie to watch. While searching for a movie to watch, it also displays a rating system based on what other people think of the movie. Let's say I finally decided to watch Army of the Dead. Tapping on the movie brings up information about the movie including movie posters and backdrops that can be downloaded to your device. You can also check the movie cast, similar movies, recommendation, but most importantly, it shows the people's comments and reviews about the movie with the spoilers blurred out. All you have to do to see the spoiler is tap to unblur the review containing the spoiler. If you want to watch the movie later, you can add it to your watch list, but tapping on the TV icon will show you which services streams that movie. The next app is Warden. We are beginning to break out from the illusion of privacy we thought we had. We do share information with organizations for the provision of a free service such as Gmail, Facebook or WhatsApp. But we've recently begun to realize the extent these apps go to take more data than we ever knew they were taking. Warden pulls back the curtain, allowing you to see how your phone apps track you and what they log by scanning all your apps. Tapping on an individual app will give you an overview of what the app entails as well as the loggers, the trackers and permissions granted to that app. You can go to the start section to see how many trackers and loggers you have on your device. If your device is rooted, you can use the debloater option to disable, hide or uninstall apps with suspicious trackers or you could use the naked option to disable all known trackers. Meteor Speed Test is an internet speed testing app that not only performs a speed test but also examines how various apps of your choice will perform with your current speed. You can select up to 6 apps to see how the download speed affects their performance. At the end of the test, it provides the standard download, upload and ping data, but it also contextualizes this data by indicating how well various apps will perform with your internet speed and the ratings it gives is poor, good and awesome. But that's not all, it also lets you see the network coverage map so if you are moving to a new location, you can check the coverage of the network around you down to the street level from 3G to 5G as well as the various network providers allowing you to make an informed decision on which network to use. And as more people use the app to check network speeds, it will paint a more accurate picture of the various network coverages. Moises Music Editor is an incredible app that rendered me speechless because it is able to take a song and separate the vocals, drums, bass and other sounds. The equivalent of what this app is doing would be someone giving me a cup of tea and me asking them to separate the milk from the tea, which is pretty difficult to do if not impossible. This is what Moises has managed to do. They've made the process so easy that all you need to do is upload your song, choose if you want the song separated into two tracks which would be vocals and instruments or four tracks which would be vocals, drums, bass and others. After it's done uploading, the process of separation is cloud based which you can then tap to download when it's finished processing. The free version of the app allows you to upload and process about 5 songs every month. You can change the playback speed from 107 bits per minute to 131 bits per minute and the pitch could be changed from minus 1 to 1. Let's take a look.
as an Android and Windows PC user, wirelessly transferring files between my phone and computer has never been easy. I've tried apps like AirDroid, Pushbullet, SendAnywhere and Samsung Flow. If I had to choose just one, it would be Samsung Flow due to its ease of use. And this is where Samsung hopes to get an advantage. Of course you could use wired connection, but there are times when I would prefer wireless simply because I didn't have my charging cable nearby or couldn't be bothered. To get started, download Samsung Flow from the Microsoft Store for your PC and Google Play for your phone. Open the Samsung Flow app on your computer and begin the connection process where you can select between Bluetooth and Wi-Fi. After everything is connected, you can select a specific folder where you want all transfers between your phone and computer to be saved and that's all there is to it. You can now easily transfer files between the two platforms. Thanks for watching guys, do remember to hit the like button, subscribe and turn on notifications. As always, remain safe and I will see you in the next one.